Scott was in Riviera Beach today touting job growth in Florida. Our Chris Emma was there. And Chris, what can you tell us? Good afternoon, Tiffany. I'm here in a lab in Riviera Beach. It's owned by a company called Metatox right now. Now, you can see right behind me right here, this was where just a short time ago, Governor Rick Scott praised the medical company for adding new jobs to Palm Beach County. The governor praised the West Palm Beach Company, which started back in 2011, which is four employees, and now has more than 200 employees, and they will be adding 90 more this year. Governor Scott cited his tax cuts and also his administration's elimination of many regulations as to why jobs are being created right here in the county. If you, if you give money back to companies, they're going to either hire more people, they're going to put it in marketing, they're going to put it in research, and what we'll do is it'll grow our workforce in our state. The governor also said he wants to eventually phase out the business tax in Florida. He says the state can afford it. We now have a $1.8 billion surplus. We've already, we have the highest funding for K-12 education. We want to increase it there this year so we'll have the highest per pupil. Uh, we're putting money into the environment and we can cut taxes. We can do all these things. Well, the governor certainly has quite a bit of battle still ahead of him for the, from the Florida legislature. That current Florida legislative session is running t through May 1st. Reporting live from Riviera Beach, I'm Chris Emma, WPBF 25 News. Back to you in the studio. All right, Chris, thank you. Governor